Hey, what is up, YouTube? This is Scooty BMX here. First part is Scooty BMX. The second part is my friend Colby, as you know. And today we have my, my sexy bike right here, Fit Conway 2. I'm actually doing the review today. Yesterday, I didn't get to it. I was a little, a little bit. I was a little busy. The school, of course, because school is always like that. But. I'm also going to be updating on my scooter. I am getting new wheels tomorrow. I was supposed to get them today, but United States Postal Service decided not to deliver today. Huh, wonderful, isn't it? I am getting the Root Industry uh, Honey Cores. Yes. And I used to have Root Industry Hollow Cores Marley, the Marley pair. It's a Bob Marley colors. But, yeah. This is what my wheel looks like now. My, it used to be my front wheel. Great. <laughs> so I'm using one of these on the front and this one mildly on the back. It's, it's oil slick. It looks nice, but the Euro thing sucks and the bearings suck and it's a little bit ovalized, so it's not going to be dialed that well, which I'm not really happy about. And I should hopefully get my wheels tomorrow morning, tomorrow afternoon, or Sunday. I hope, but that's just a little update on the scooter. We are going to me and Colby are going to some wait Picture Rock skate park tomorrow. Even though I don't have my new wheels yet, I'm just gonna have to use my spare. But we are going to get clips there. We're gonna have fun there. It's gonna be awesome. But let's get on to the Conway. So as you can see, we I saw the stock tires fit. Of course, most things are fit on this bike. I do have fit tires. I did take tire paint, tire marker, and put that white line, the white wall, which I think personally looks very sexy. I love it. And I got the Shadow Conspiracy pegs I got from Colby, because he used to ride, and he had Shadow Conspiracy pegs, chrome, which match my hubs and my spokes. And I got the nice copper rims. And I got, this bike comes with the free coaster. Back here, there is a free coaster. Amazing. I have a Primo hub guard. Primo, Primo hub guard. KMC half link chain. If you get a half link chain from KMC, beware. They break easily. I think half links are strong. I had to fix my one of my links snapped off. So you know I got the stock fit fabricated seat. Fit sprocket, chrome. Everything's fit on here pretty much except my pedals. I got demolition pedals. Which I really love them. They're good. Fit crank arms. Fit cranks. Bottom bracket. Fit. Forks fit. Bar spit. Everything's fit. Stem fit. It's top loaded. Love it. The Colt Vans grips. Um. See, what else do we got? Up spit, of course. That's pretty much it. That's pretty much good. This bike, at least. But this bike. It is amazing, so she's a little dirty. I was riding it, but she, it is amazing. I do highly, highly recommend it. Like, highly. I mean, I got this at my local bike shop for about $550, which is not too bad. It's a little expensive, but it's worth it. Love it. It's a right hand drive, so if you grind on the right side, get some kind of half length chain from Shadow Conspiracy. Don't get it from KMC. It's not the best. But get it from Shadow Conspiracy or get a um, chain guard sprocket. Okay, and then if you slip off the crank arm, it does the crank arm and dent it a tiny bit, but that's perfectly fine. But besides that, there's nothing else to this bike besides it's amazing. And I do you should you should put if you get this bike put the white line on it, it looks sexy. 
highly, highly recommend that. It gives it that like old style look, but it's not old, but it still looks good. And do do get a hub guard in the back at least. And one thing about the front axles, they do bend if you do like 50-50. No, double peg. I'm used to saying that because I used to have I used to not have pegs on my scooter. Double peg grinds or Smith grinds, it does bend. Beware. This will bend down. It will tilt down. Right now I kind of like switched it back up and bent it back. But you do that and it will it will mess up your hub quite a lot, pushing the bearings. I mean it works fine for me. I kind of like I kinda of fixed it. Just just loosen a tiny bit that does happen. Loosen the hub guards. No. Loosen the lock nuts. And that will work fine. But um that's pretty much it to this bike. On my headset, I do have a I can't remember what it's called. It's aftermarket. Because my old headset broke. I can't remember. I think I when I put compression back on I did it wrong, completely wrong. I was a noob back then when I first got this. But highly recommend this bike. It's amazing. Love it to death. And for Christmas. Ugh. And if you're on slight budget, this bike works for you. It's not the most expensive, not the cheapest. But it's good. But the rims it does the rear rim is double wall, but the front rim sadly isn't double wall, but back rim is more yeah the back rim is more bent than the front surprisingly the double wall but this back I guess that's all I got for you today and I'll see you in the next video like subscribe comment share with a friend if you want do what you want, and bye.